It's time for Wreckfish SA to go. The government must dissolve the organisation. It does not represent the interests of South Australia's recreational fishers. It's demonstrated this by supporting government cuts to your fishing rights, supporting PERS's flawed data, supporting implementation of regulations to give more marine fisheries to the commercial sector. By its actions, it is infringing your constitutional right to fish. Wreckfish SA supported the introduction of marine parks. It supported reduced bag limits for King George Whiting, a 50% hack to the Blue Swimmer Crab bag limits and other cuts. A new group must be formed, made up of grassroots fishers and representatives from SAFA, Fish and SA, Wreckfish Central and other groups that actually go into bat for the recreational fisher. Recreational fishing contributed more than $1.2 billion, that's right, $1.2 billion to the state last year. The commercial scale fishery contributed just $28 million. So why in the hell is this government killing off a section of the community worth that much to the state in order to prop up a commercial sector that fishes out complete areas with long lines for snapper? new pot techniques and bigger boats for commercial crab fishers, and no limits for their take of King George Whiting. The commercials, when under fire, always fall back to this common quote. We supply the local market with fresh fish, so the community can have a feed of fresh fish. But what they don't say is that 80% of their catch is exported to Melbourne or Sydney or overseas, and what you get is the leftovers. They get more dollars by exporting it, but you pay the same inflated price for some pretty poor looking species. We as a country import 80% of our seafood while we export 80% of our own. So what they want you to do is eat bassa fillets from polluted Asian mud pens or eat prawns that have been injected with a gel produced in China. Oh, they're going to be yummy all right. This is the end result of Wreckfish SA supporting the ethos of PERSA and the government. Get a new organisation in there to fight for your rights. Email Fisheries Minister Bignall asking him to dissolve Wreckfish SA immediately. You can find his address on the net. It's not that much work, but you need to do it if you want to go fishing with your kids in the future.